Hello everyone, Blix here, and today we have finally got, finally, a new look at the January and February releases for Beyblade X, and they look pretty cool. So, um, yeah, starting off we have BX26 Unicorn Sting. Here's a somewhat of a side profile. The parts are 560 and gear point. So, it's not gear taper, it's actually gear point. So, judging by that bit, you can obviously tell that this is a balance type release. I do like the colors on it. The gimmick of it is what I'm most excited to use. As you can see, it has like a jagged side and then a smooth side. Um, I'm really excited to see how that'll be in battles. The unicorn like avatar on the bay, I feel like it could have looked cooler had the eyes been like white instead of yellow or something. I don't know. It's not terrible looking. I just wish, I feel like we could have got a better looking unicorn avatar, but it, it's, it's definitely not bad at all. And then moving on to February, this is the Sphinx Cowl short random booster. And I'm not gonna lie, this might be up there with like my favorite random booster yet. Um, even though it is a short random booster, because the parts and colors they picked for every single Sphinx Cowl variant in this short random booster is amazing. You got the prize one, which is like the yellow and blue one. It looks great. The shape is interesting. Um, I feel like the shape could result in it being mid or bad in competitive, but we'll have to see. Uh, the red and black one looks amazing. Red and black are my two favorite colors, so I love that. And then a white and blue one, and that is actually the Sphinx Cowl variant that Bird battles in the next Beyblade X episode. So it's cool that they're actually doing random booster recolors in the anime, finally. And then here are the parts. So the main prize bay is 980 gear needle. The red and black one is 480 high taper and the white and blue one is 560 orb. This is our first orb recolor, which is also cool. And then we get something that I was just completely not expecting. We get our first look or teaser at the UX system. Um, so yeah, this is a like completely new system in Beyblade X from what we've seen so far. And you can tell because like the three little tabs that are uh, normally metal are plastic this time. It has like a very, like a very Excalibur-esque shape almost. I have no idea what bay this is going to be, but we do get our first little hint at the UX system. So I'm very excited to when it gets fully revealed but yeah that's about all the news we got today um still a lot more than i was expecting i was just expecting us to get a look at the unicorn bay but we got triple that so i'm really excited um let me know what you guys are going to be copying down in the comments below are y'all are y'all gonna get unicorn sting phoenix sphinx cowl uh are you excited for the ux system let me know below i hope you all enjoyed and peace